Hi there, my name is Anne Louise Wells and I am the owner of Larkin to be Creative. Today I'm going to show you how to upload a sales page into your sales funnel in Kajabi. So let's dive right in. So if we go into Kajabi, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on website. And this is going to bring you to the platform area where, where all of your websites live. Um, but where we need to go is into pages. And there's three tabs here. There's the website tab. This shows you all of the live pages that are within your current live website. Um, now, this doesn't apply to landing pages or sales pages. So where we want to go is landing. Now in the landing section, and I'll, I'll, show, I'll also show you how to do funnels afterwards, but the first thing you're going to want to do, even if you're doing a funnel, is you're going to want to upload your sales page here first. So there's a button up here that says upload template. Now you might have purchased a template from myself or from a particular, but in any case, it'll show up as a zipped folder. You want to keep it zipped. You don't want to unzip that folder and try to pick out what you're supposed to upload. Keep it simple. You're going to upload the entire zip folder. So I'm going to click here. Here's my Freya's Garden sales page. I'm going to click open. And it's going to start uploading. It sounds like it's working. So it's installing the template now. It takes a few moments. Once that template is installed, it's going to open it in your editor right away. Now, because this is a long form sales page, this can take a few minutes. And sometimes you'll even get a pop-up that says, um, would, you like, would you like to skip this step um, or wait? So please click on wait because sometimes it just takes a few more seconds of waiting just because it has the page has so many sections. You wanna make sure that you give it the time to fully upload. And here we have it. So now you'd be able to edit this page, no problem. Um, but that's not what I'm going to show you today. <laughs> so we're going to go back to where all of the sales pages are. And I'm going to show you how to upload it to funnels. But for, first, before I do that, um, just so you know, here are these three dots here. If you wanted to change the name of the sales page, you would do that here. You can view the analytics from here. You could even duplicate this page if you have a few different offers that you're doing and you want to reuse the same sales page um, and then just edit a few things to customize it. This is how you would do that. You can copy the URL. So let's say you have a section in your website where you want people to see your sales page. You can put a button on your website with the link. You would copy this URL and put it on the button in your website and people can actually access your sales page from your website. Um, this is to modify any coding, this is to export, and this is to update, pay update pages. Sometimes Kajabi ups, updates their entire system and so uh, you might need to sometimes update the page. So that's how that works. Um, so if you were to add it to a funnel, we're going to click on funnels here. And so I don't have any funnels right now, so let's create a new one. So I'm going to click on new funnel. And then, um, and then it's, it gives you options of what type of funnel you're creating here. So let's just do the freebie. So we'll do get started. Let's name our funnel. We'll do Freya's Garden Funnel. And let's get started. So what Kajabi does on the back end is just formulating the flow of this particular funnel. And then once it's mapped out, then you get the blueprint. So this is what it looks like. So let's say, so in this uh, freebie, you get an opt-in, you get a funnel email se sequence, and then you get a thank you page. But let's say you wanted to add a sales page to this funnel. Um, how would you do that? So if you notice here, if you uh, hover over between the boxes, actually you can't do it here, but you can do it here, you can add a page. Okay, so if you wanted to see if you were to pick a new landing page, um, you would then click next. And here it kind of shows you the different options uh, that Kajabi offers as themes. So if you click on sale pa sales page, you click next. So these are the different uh, pipelines 
designs that they offer. But obviously we just uploaded a sales page. Um, so we're going to upload that one to our sequence in our funnel. So then you would select this one and you would click on next. And then you can upload the one that you just uploaded. Now you might want to edit it first. You might want to customize it to exactly what you want. Add your content in there, uh, create your entire offer before you go and upload it here. But either way, you don't have to do it that way. You can edit it after within, within the funnel. So either way works, but you, the one thing, the step that is important is that you upload that sales page to your landing pages before you go and add it to your funnel. And now you have it, you have your sales page as part of your funnel. So now you can start customizing and editing and making sure that everything works. Um, but yeah, that's how you do it. You could even add another page before, another page after, depending on what your strategy is. Um, but ultimately that is how you add a landing page or a sales page to your Kajabi funnel. Thank you so much. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to message me. Um, and if you're also interested in purchasing the theme that I showed within this uh, training, you can, you can purchase it in the link below in the description of my video. Thank you so much.